All right, guys, let's just dive in and get started. I want to show you how easy it is to set up a blog uh, and just do it real quick. So I'm on the page you're on right now. I'm just going to click the Bluehost link below. Uh, above this video, I talk about why I use Bluehost. And what you're going to do is just click sign up now. And what you're going to get is unlimited domain hosting, unlimited gigabyte hosting space, unlimited file transfer, unlimited email accounts. So basically, the important points are with this one account, you're going to be able to put unlimited amounts of domains on it. So you're going to have unlimited websites on this one account. Okay, so it's going to be $6.95 a month to do that. So I'm going to enter my domain name as my business. Okay. Um, actually, it's not that. It's .net. Okay. Click next, and then in the near future, you can add as many domain names as you want from behind the scenes in as we log in. So I'm just going to put all my stuff in here and just pause real quick. Okay, and scroll down, and the pro package you can upgrade to pro. Um, which I really don't recommend. I don't think you need that. So there's some things you can untick here that you do not need, like Site Backup Pro or Site Lock Domain Security or Who Is Domain Privacy. You don't need any of those things. And here, the account plan, it should be pointed out that the $6.95 price is for the 36-month price. So if you want the 12-month price, it goes up to $7.95 a month. Okay. And then you put in your billing information and click next. And I'm just going to go ahead and go to my account now at this point. Okay, so as soon as you've purchased your plan, you go back to Bluehost and uh, wait for the email and they just send you your control panel login. So I'm just going to go to my login here and click that. And I've got it entered in. And it just goes into my cPanel account, this is called. This is the background of the hosting account, okay? This is where up here you can check the domains that you have or purchase domains in the domain manager. There's different site builders, uh, all sorts of stuff up here. But what we're mostly worried about here is just scrolling down to simple scripts and clicking WordPress. That's the software we're going to use to make websites uh, from now on. OK, so you just scroll down and click Install. And you can click the drop down menu to where you would like to install your WordPress, whichever domain name you have on here. And click the advanced options, click to display, and give your site a new name, the cool site. All right. And you know, if your website is about golf practice nets, you might want to call it, you know, best golf practice nets or something like that. Um, username, I'm just going to leave as admin, and I'm going to put in my password blur that out, automatically create new database. Don't worry about changing anything there. Step three, plugins and themes. I'm just going to untick all three of these things. I don't need those. And step four, legal information. I've read it. And I'll click complete. And now it's just going ahead and installing. OK, and it's got everything, all my information here with my username and the password. And I'm just going to go ahead and click on the login URL now to go straight there and begin working on my, my blog. And I'll type in my username and password and log in. OK, and let's go to Posts now and click All Posts. All right, and here's a marker post that they have uh, already put in to this blog. It's just part of the installation. I can just trash this by scrolling over trash and clicking trash. Then I'm going to add a new post. All right, and I'll go ahead and add it and say test post. This is a test post. Okay, and then I'm just going to click publish. OK, and let's go ahead and scroll over here and visit the website right now. OK, and here's our blog now, the cool site, it's called. That was the where we put the name in. 
And here's the test post. It just says test post. And then here's the text underneath it. This is a test post right here. 